Uh, Chief Meteorologist Scott Padgett, we have a weather alert that's in place for today for some rain that's ahead for this Labor Day weekend, too. Tell us what you know. This yeah, well, what I know is that we're going to see showers and storms every single day. We're alerting you to that fact that we just want you to pay attention as you're going to be making your plans through your holiday weekend. Scattered showers and storms. I don't anticipate severe weather. We might see some stronger storms, but I want to break this down for you. So daily scattered showers and storms in the forecast. Severe weather not expected. Isolated strong storms possible. Could see some 50 mile per hour wind gusts, uh, heavy rain and some lightning. Uh, so be, stay weather aware during any hour outdoor activities as we're going through your Labor Day holiday weekend. 30% uh, chance for today. I dropped that just a bit. So I do expect to see that mix of sun and clouds through the day ahead. 92 degrees up to, to about 40 percent for Saturday. That is Sunday to Monday, a 50 50 shot with temperatures holding on into the mid 80s. If you're traveling across parts of uh, the Lone Star State, we're going to be seeing 88 in Houston to 88 by Sunday. 96 though in San Antonio with that mix of sun and clouds greeting you right now. Our first alert satellite and radar combined work quiet here, but I'm tracking the cold front off towards the northwest. This is going to be sliding its way slowly down to the south and east, and as it does so, that increases our lift for some showers and storms developing later today, and then it stalls out. And that's why we have shower and storm chances every single day this holiday weekend. We're at 76 right now. Dew point of 72 degrees with a southeast wind at 773 right now in Stephenville to 73 in Terrell. So as we go through the morning hours, we'll see 84 degrees by the time we get to 11 and then into the afternoon hours, making it up to about 91 to 92, feeling slightly warmer than that because of that moisture that's here in place, that Gulf moisture hanging out. All right, here's the first alert future cast. You can see the scattered showers and some storms developing for us late morning hours as we go into the afternoon, a bit more coverage on the way, so just stay weather aware. Here's the frontal boundary slowly sliding its way in late tonight, then into tomorrow. Activity tapers off tonight, then into tomorrow, it just stalls out. And then into the afternoon hours, the heat of the day, we see these showers and storms developing as we go then into the evening hours. Some spots possibly picking up a large amount of rain. How much are we talking about? Well, we could see, I think, the west side of North Texas, higher amounts, maybe an inch and a half to near two and a half inches of rain of areas, not a whole lot. So your first alert, seven day forecast, which you asked for when you took the survey. I want to see that every single time you talk weather shows that we have the wet weather on the way. Still some rain chances on Tuesday at 40% and then by next Thursday temperatures back up to near 90 degrees, but not a 100 degree day uh, in the forecast, which is nice. Unfortunately, a lot of rain off and on as we go through our holiday guys and we could certainly use the rain too. So Scott, thank you so much for keeping us prepared for this holiday weekend. We appreciate you.